everyone, welcome and welcome back to Mutant Space. It's a Star Wars kind of day and I have this beautiful art prints here at my back and I'm so excited to showcase to you guys. So if you like the video, click the thumbs up and help me share with everyone and also subscribe to my channel, The Inchance Place. It looks good kill. If looks good kill. here with the beautiful Asajj Ventress uh, Ascension this is actually from Saiju Collectibles this is done by Darren Tan has an edition size of 450 that's quite sad so it seems like Saiju is really pumping up those edition sizes so it's really beautiful I love the colors and everything the composition and I think this is even also like a the same concept as the one of uh, the Mythos line from Saiju Collectibles their stages of Star Wars Mythos and there's a Asajj, the Asajj Ventress also, this is pretty awesome and really good. It has a, um, let's say, typical sideshow dimension as well, which is 18 by 24. I like being dangerous. My name is Notorious. I like being dangerous. One of my favorite um, aspect of this piece is really the color scheme. Um, why? One of which is the, as you can see, there is a color. The the light uh, from the lightsaber. Uh, it actually shows like a highlight in her arms. That is pretty beautifully done. Like really good. Like like I said, the the color in this one is very bold. Um, it's like orange and there's also the, the red and the black and there's like the pink or I don't know I, I think it's pink but that again the combination is very good very bold uh, eye popping uh, makes this really beautiful it actually in, uh, emphasizes more how dark Asajj Ventress is and the world around her which is pretty awesome the, the, the background is really good I also the second aspect that I really love is the details in in her cloak or I'm not sure if it's called cloak but the costume it's beautifully done like really beautiful the, the line work there um, how it flows is amazing like really nicely done I love it and with a touch of the the face that is pretty good so as I mentioned again this was um, uh, the same concept as the I would say the the mythos statue so that's why you can see also the, some bones here um, which is actually also in the statue as well and again this is a very beautiful stuff um, I kind of also regret that I didn't get the framed one because the framed one is also spectacular so really great job by Darren Dan so this is a such Ventress Ascension second piece is actually uh, I got it from bottleneck uh, gallery I actually <laughs> to be honest I totally forgot I got this print uh, this is entitled um, high noon this is a Mandalorian this is Mando really beautifully done this is also uh, done by uh, Pablo Oliveira uh, I hope I pronounce it correctly uh, but it doesn't come in just one piece it actually comes in two so there is actually a variant version of this one and this is actually the variant version um, this is also still entitled high noon this has an edition side of 175 and this one i think it's 275 so it's pretty beautiful let me show you i hope it focuses there look at that one really beautiful this is the variant version it has a uh, more of a, I would say, a, a, a brownish tone.
some details regarding this. This is Mando. If you if you have seen the uh, Mandalorian series by Disney, um, he has this Mandalorian steel, uh, or I, I forgot how it's called. These are actually like his prizes uh, when he got his bounty, and he's like basically putting it on. I really do wish it would be in the other side so that if he, the, he we can see the the rhino alien stuff or species that would have been amazing and that's the only nitpick for me regarding this but nonetheless it has a very beautiful highlighting and shadows in in the uh, in his armor I really love the highlights that it shaped him here I think the what I like about this one is that it has this brownish feel but this one actually looks pretty good in camera um, it has a very how would say saturated color um, really looks good I, I really love it um, again th these two are pretty amazing I'm not sure I wouldn't I don't see this anymore in battle neck um, gallery but maybe you can still find it somewhere but it's really good this is a size of 24 by um, 8, 18 so this is not the screen print but the paper here is quite good I really am not sure um, the details of regarding how it's printed I'm not sure if this is sickly maybe um, I'm not all it doesn't also have this uh, details like shy side show giving like 300 GSM it doesn't have that um, or maybe I forgot because in the battle neck it's already like removed but either way the details are again are very phenomenal I love really the highlights and everything um, and also the armor it has a very good details the folds um, his his belt really amazing stuff so this is high noon uh, by Pablo Oliveira Definitely the gem of the group is the Star Wars Far Away Galaxy screen print by Scott Campbell. Not the J. Scott Campbell, just Scott Campbell. Um, this is amazing. This is very beautiful. I, I'm not sure if this is something that uh, combines all the Star Wars, the first trilogy. I think this is just the, the New Hope. This is the different scenes of the New Hope. Um, really good stuff. I love how they, how, how he made it cartoony, but at the same time very detailed. Like for example, the the cafeteria uh, where they they met Han Solo. <laughs> this one is very crowded. Looks absolutely good. There's a lot of different um, species, aliens uh, in here. I really love that. And there's also the details when uh, they already won. Um, the when they tried to uh, when after they destroyed the Death Star, the ceremony there. This is beautifully done as well. Like I really love this because it shows like like a quick summary of the movie itself. So really beautiful. I love. I, I like that he made it cartoony and it has a very beautiful feel that it's like a watercolor. I'm not sure if this is screen print though. I think it might be a Zikli. Um, because if this is screen print, it wouldn't have this too much color. But either way, it has a screen print size. This is really amazing. I'm gonna have this framed as well because I really love it. Uh, like I said, this is the gem of the batch. Um, really, really good stuff. Really beautifully done. It gives an overall picture of the new home. <laughs> 